Well, you see that system to our south, that's going to give us a push of moisture and cloud cover that's not only going to change temperatures, but could potentially bring us better chances for rain as we head into Sunday. Now, closer to home, we have seen uh, a flood advisory in southern portions of Clark County. You see that spilling over into San Bernardino, just south of uh, Sandy Valley. And as I step out here, you can see some storms to our east, but it looks like as it loses the daytime heating, it's going to fall apart and not make its way into the Las Vegas Valley. However, tomorrow could be a different story. You see, we're quite dry right now, 12% humidity here in Las Vegas. It's been a very hot day. Uh, high temperatures have surpassed 105, but Notice we get this push of moisture tomorrow, so this is going to increase our possibilities for isolated showers here in the valley. Of course, the best opportunity is going to be in the mountains. Then it sort of starts to drop off. I think we're still going to have a slight chance on Labor Day, uh, but the farther we move away from uh, this afternoon, the drier it's going to get. Notice this is uh, 12 o'clock on Tuesday. We're really going to be cranking up the heat on that day. So here are your chances for rain. They're not great, but it does look like an improvement with that moisture surge from the south. So a slight chance for maybe isolated storms tomorrow coming down for Labor Day. Still the possibility of a stray storm and then there will still be enough of that monsoon moisture in place to not completely take out chances for rain, but they're going to be very, very slight. Oh, and by the way, uh, temperatures on Monday looking a little bit better. 102 partly cloudy skies and again, still the uh, opportunity for that stray storm, particularly in the afternoon. So tonight 82 degrees, 80 in Henderson and in Boulder City Anthem uh, 78. So some portions of the valley will be dropping down into the 70s. Quite a nice morning tomorrow. We're going to see the bulk of the cloud cover in the first part of the day. That's going to shave a few degrees off high temperatures. Take a look. 101 Henderson Boulder City, 100 for central portions of the valley. North Las Vegas at 100 and Parham just the same. So if you're headed outdoors at all tomorrow, it's looking better than today. We're going to see more cloud cover. Temperatures aren't going to be as hot, 94 in Red Rock. So if you can get out in the morning, uh, it could be a nice day for a hike. Mount Charlton, of course, picture perfect at 76. And Lake Mead, still quite hot. More sunshine out there, of course, than around the more mountainous areas. So here's your 13 First Alert 7-Day Planner. By Labor Day, we bring it up a few degrees. And still, the potential each and every afternoon after tomorrow for a stray storm. Really, it's going to be, for the most part, limited to the mountains. But remember, sometimes we don't necessarily get rain. We get gusty winds. We saw a lot of that last week, uh, but the good news is that we shave a degree or two off temperatures each and every afternoon after Tuesday. We even have a 98 in there next Saturday, so something to look forward to. So we are finally getting a little bit of relief with those clouds coming in and the red temperatures coming down just a little bit, huh? Yes, tomorrow, Monday, sort of, it comes up and then we come back down. Okay, that's not bad news. Yeah. Thank you, Carla. You're welcome.